different, we're fresh, we're creative, we're innovative. When it comes to culinary creativity, Spiro Stogianis talks a big game. We're not riding the wave, we're creating the wave. We're the tsunami that's coming to change the game. But when you see the kind of food he's serving, you'll know it ain't bragging if you can back it up. Are you hungry? At his restaurant, Easy Pie, Spiro makes some of the biggest, boldest, craziest, and tastiest over-the-top eats you'll ever experience. You know, we think outside the box all the time. If it's something that's somewhere else, we don't want it. If it's something that we've seen somewhere before, we don't want it. We want to be the wave makers in the industry. Spiro started making waves when he opened the original Easy Pie in Braintree almost a decade ago. And now at this brand new industrial chic spot on Squire Road in Revere, he's taking eye-popping Easy Eats to the next level with outrageous pizzas, enormous burgers, monster tater tots, and so much more you simply must taste to believe. I want people to experience this culinary masterpiece of a menu that we've put together. I definitely think it's something that you've never had before, and you never will. <laughs> So what makes a meal at Easy Pie so different? Well, here's a pretty clear example. They've taken everything you love about a poo-poo platter and put it on a pizza. It's called The Last Dragon. And this thing is absolutely insane. First, we start off with our homemade duck sauce. And we rub that in nice and sexy. Little pizza cheese. Then we add our fried rice. Little beef teriyaki. Asso pork like your traditional boneless spare ribs. Tempura chicken. And fresh chopped egg roll. Some of our signature blend pizza cheese. And in she goes. Fresh out of the oven, top it off with some uh, nice chopped scallion and a little duck sauce drizzle. And that's that. It tastes like every single item in a poo-poo platter in one bite. And a lot of people think we should serve it with fortune cookies, so we're working on that. But it's definitely a very crazy pizza. It's full flavored and it's impressive. Equally impressive is the fully loaded pizza topped with bacon infused smashed potatoes, crispy ranch chicken, more bacon, and finished with chives and a seasoned sour cream drizzle. It tastes like a fully loaded baked potato with fried chicken and a bunch of extra stuff on it. Since Easy Pie is located in Revere, the birthplace of the roast beef sandwich, Spiro decided to make a pizza out of one of those too. This is the mecca for roast beef three-way sandwiches. And I said, you know what? I'm gonna do what we do best. I'm gonna make a pizza, but I'm gonna make a roast beef three-way pizza. It starts off with James River barbecue sauce. It has American cheese on it. It has thin sliced rare roast beef on it. It has chopped up onion roll on it. And it has cheese on it. When it comes out, it has a mayonnaise drizzle. The flavors are amazing. And crazy pizzas are more than just a meal here. They're also dessert with sweet combinations that are equally inventive, like this baklava pizza made with crispy phyllo, chopped walnuts, and cinnamon, or the top-selling strawberry shortcake pizza. So we use our signature dessert crust, and it has a frosting base on it, fresh chopped strawberries. It has white chocolate chips on it. For the shortcake, we use Twinkies. We have a sauce that we put on top of it. We call it unicorn drizzle, just to finish it off and give it that look. Little dusting of powdered sugar, and the rest is history. It tastes like a strawberry shortcake on a pizza. <laughs> If you prefer a burger, Easy Pie's versions go way beyond the standard stack. Whether you order the Cinna Burger, featuring a half pound plus patty, bacon, and cheddar served between two ice cinnamon rolls, the Detroit Rock City topped with yellow mustard, house-made chili, and a quarter pound hot dog, or the Double Down, piled high with two all-beef patties, American cheese, lettuce, onions, pickles, and Thousand Island dressing. If you want to come in here and you're feeling like a total animal, like a beast, you have the Double Down. That burger conquers a lot of hungry people. It's a very, very big burger. For something only slightly more manageable, check out this chicken and waffle inspired sandwich named the chicken not so little. It has our really massive hand cut country fried chicken breast on it. It has a scrambled egg on top of it. It has our apple with smoked bacon. It has two slices of American cheese. It's doused in maple syrup and it's between two Belgian waffles. Just tastes like chicken and waffles on steroids. Want fries with that? Why bother when you can have a monster tot instead. This thing is a tater tot, one tater tot, and it's bigger than your head. And we've developed an entire menu called the monster tot menu. So we feature a tot called the gangster tot, and it's topped with Kraft mac and cheese, a ton of bacon on top of it, a chipotle and ranch aioli, and it's finished uh, with some fresh chives. People just absolutely go berserk when they see it. And as you might imagine, a lot of the food at Easy Pie has become insta-famous, which is just fine with Spiro. The food comes out 
out and its cell phone's out first. No one touches the food until they snap a photo and put it on Instagram or Facebook. I'd like to think that we're not in the food business, we're in the reaction business, you know? We need to make food that people have never seen before or tasted before. We've created our own lane and we drive down this lane a million miles an hour and no one's catching us. Mm -hmm.